Hello everyone, this is Sadria and you're watching and listening to Heart of Gold Inspiration. Now today is Monday, it's the beginning of the work week. Yes, a short work week, yes. So most of us will have uh, tomorrow off for the holiday. And I'm excited because I've got a lot of stuff to do this week. And I am looking forward to being in Denver, Colorado Thursday. Yes, I will be at the 46th annual Compassionate Friends Network Conference. Yes, this conference is for bereaved parents, grandparents, and for siblings who have um, who experienced the grief of the death of a sibling. Now, I will be the keynote speaker for Saturday, sharing with everyone transformation from pain to purpose. And it is important that we always strive to either figure out what our purpose is in this world, in this earth, right now in our life, our lifetime. What is my purpose? And I want to do it with passion. So if you have a purpose, absolutely do it with passion. You can't do one without the other. You can fulfill your purpose, but if you're not doing it with passion, you're not, you might not even do on your purpose. So I enjoy fulfilling each day working in my purpose okay I do it and I enjoy it and I know that it makes a difference in other people's lives now my granddaughters are gone for two weeks they have their vacation time with their other grandmother and of course they've called me twice no well, three times the check-in and they are going to have a great day today. They're going, they told me they were going swimming today. And I told them to be careful, to wear their vest, their water vest and earplugs. Um, but they're excited to have some summertime fun. And when they get back in two weeks, I'm gonna turn right back around and they're going to see their great grandparents. Yes, for another week. So Sadri's gonna have three weeks of working on extra things that I can do and get things started now last week let me tell you i started the week off great then the middle of the week felt a little down but then by thursday i'm so excited i got so many projects going on you guys i'm just like oh this is exciting but anyway i love sharing with each and every one of you the weekly affirmation and I am rethinking this podcast and doing something extra out there for all of my bereaved mothers, donor mothers, mothers general who have uh, lost, uh, experienced the loss and grief of their child, no matter what age. Okay. I keep getting that brought back to me from individuals like, you really ought to do this. So. I'm working on it, writing out my plan, then I'm going to put it into action. And of course, I will let you know. But we are here for the weekly affirmation, correct? Yes. So let's get ready for our weekly affirmation. I am grateful for this day. I wake up knowing and affirming that today will be a positive start of a wonderful week. I am ready to experience this beautiful life that I am creating with my vision, my thoughts, and my actions. That's it. So I hope that you wake up today with any task that you have to get started with. And if you wake up not this energized, you know what I say, do what you gotta do to wake up. Whether it's a cup of tea, a cup of coffee, a workout, a walk, yoga, prayer, meditation, whatever it is that gets your day started, I want you to do that, okay? And remember that you have the capacity. You have everything within you to create the life that you want. Now, before I end, I always end with, if you're not an organ donor, 
I encourage you to become one today. You can go to our website at briannasheartofgold.org and there is a link where you can register to be a donor with Brianna's very own campaign link with Donate Life America called BHG 7 and 7. You can go to the register.me, well, registerme.org forward slash BHG, the number 7, I N, the number 7. So you can register to be an organ donor, and it is important that you share that decision with your family members and specifically the person that will be making that decision for you because they will fulfilling what they will be fulfilling that wish for you. Brianna saved the lives of four individuals, and because of her, they were giving more days, more years, many memories with their family and friends. So leave a legacy, a legacy of life, a legacy of hope, a legacy of love. If you're about that life, donate life. Have a wonderful week. And I hope that you make today the best day yet. <laughs>